In this tutorial, you will learn the basics of how to create a schema in the management console of Rideback Extreme. Here on the left, select schemas, then new. A schema is basically a representation of the database table you want to use to write your data back to. Clicking one of the schema types here on the left will display the use cases it represents. For example, when you want to do a what if scenario, you select the add data. For this demo, I will select the collaboration one. Second step is selecting the database where you want uh, the table to be. So here we select MySQL. Now we are going to define the schema. Uh, so give it a label. So let's call it collaboration. And the schema identifier is basically the table name of the database table. Now we are uh, in the fields step, and the field step is defining the columns of your new database table. Uh, the collaboration one is pre-filled with fields to get started easily, and here you can easily change, add, or delete fields um, according you to your use case. Now we create the schema, the schema is created. So we have a few optional steps that we can do. The first one is row level security. So this can be used to restrict access to data on a row level. For this demo, we will skip it to keep it simple. The next step is permissions. Um, on this step, you define the permissions of users in extension, in extension on a group level. So we can easily say that this schema should not be available for group marketing, for example then all users in the marketing group do not see this schema in their Tableau extension. And you can also uh, deselect or select uh, individual permissions uh, per group. Next step is workflows. So with workflows you can set additional actions when data is added, changed or deleted, like triggering a stored procedure for example. And now the schema is fully configured, so we can use it in our dashboard. Uh, 